From the Dawn Trail benchmark, there was one thing that stood out like a sore thumb to me, and it's when it like pivoted to my character, turned around, and then I saw my Rothgar fully erect. Standing fully erect. Get your mind out of the damn gutter. <laughs> but this has been one of the things about Rothgar that really bothers me, and this is something that we've also seen a little bit in old World of Warcraft, where all of a sudden we saw that there was a chiropractor introduced for the orcs. This was apparently added, and I did look up on Wowhead, in 2018. And, I mean, I love our developers so much, but I am really at the point where I see this graphics update, and I cannot help but feel like, oh my god, can we please have the option for the male Rothgar to stand straight? And then I immediately pivot my entire head to female Rothgar, and then I'm like, oh wow, they stand up like perfectly straight, and I'm like, oh wow, that looks really, really good, and then I'm like, oh my god, I'd love to do that. Like, it's not that I have an issue with a little bit of a hunch, like, it's just like, I clearly love my character, the character I really resonate with and have played for literally years. Like, everyone knows I'm invested into my Rothgar, and I love it so much, I literally have art of it and everything, like, it's just like, this character, I just it's totally great but i'm really at the point where i'm feeling like the developers clearly see i'm i'm not gonna pretend that i'm stupid and that i don't see mods i don't use them especially because i make youtube videos and i truly am the himbo that i portray myself as and i if i did start using them would guarantee to probably forget that they were on upload footage onto a damn youtube video and get banned like that day but i am aware that they exist and so when they implemented the new block feature for dawn trail where the block just makes that person's character just go which is kind of what everyone wants, although I'm sure when you block some people, you kind of would rather see their character just combust into like a billion pieces, I'm sure. I can't be the only one. No, it's just me, I'm the only bloodthirsty. Okay, moving on. But the point is that they implemented a mod basically one-to-one. -one. Now the real question is when are chat bubbles coming, but we'll, we'll leave that to a different video. But when I look at my Rothgar, and then I look at like the different mods that are out there, it's just like, I really think that my character would look so much better standing just fully erect. And I say this as someone who clearly has played way too many video games, and clearly has had a hunch because that's just the way things were, and then worked laboriously. <laughs> so freaking hard like to like go to yoga to go to the gym like get the posture a little better and so now it's just something that has always kind of been in the back of my mind for years so we're talking like god like seven eight years ago i really put in an effort to like sit better and do that i invested in better chairs and everything but the thing is when we actually see like our characters in the dawn trail trailer benchmark thing and then we see our character and this has been in the game for the longest time so like if you unsheath your weapon as a rothgar and i'm gonna include like brand new footage for this you can see that the character stands up straight and it basically doesn't matter what job it is it's just like oh i'm on astro okay well my character's default standing position is now just standing straight and i always find that that looks a lot better and it's just like this already like existing game and then people will be like okay well why in the benchmark does it stand straight because i mean they're just trying to use the same like animation skeleton framework thing i'm not an anime i don't know the exact terms but you know what i'm getting at like it's just like they have like these lines with like these nodes and um, vertices that like just move around and so like they apply that just generically across the characters like i get that and that's why like if you're like in the astrology and like idle pose then your character is just gonna be in that kind of like standing straight pose i get that but my point of bringing that up is that our characters can already stand up straight and to that end this is like the number one graphics update feature i want and i don't say that lightly like trust me i think my character looks freaking great in the benchmark like even just like looking at the nostrils just looking at everything just like everything about my character I, the hair I think the hair is the last thing that I think needs a little bit of work, but everything has clearly been leveled up, like, so much. Like, it looks so... Uh, just, it's just, all the materials look gorgeous, the wire looks gorgeous, even on the reflection on my character's fur. Oh, like, these things I do notice, I mean, it might not be cyberpunk graphics, which I think some people expected, which is totally unrealistic, but it looks so much better. But at this point with the graphics update, I truly, honestly, genuinely, truly believe, and I want this more than separating hair from faces, because let's be honest, I we're getting a lot more hairstyles, and to that end, 
yes, I'm taking them. Yes, I will take all hats, even if they clip. And this is something that I have said on like Work to Game podcast and just just everywhere that I the topic's been brought up. If you have a hat, and if a little bit of Rothgar hair or ear pokes out of the hat, eh, trust me, I can get over it. I really would prefer having the option of wearing the hat and having a little bit of clipping. The clipping isn't even that bad. But my point is with the graphics update is this this or like standing up straight is that this is something that i would prefer so much more than seeing something like separating hair from faces i think separating hair from faces is very important and that gives you an idea of how like prioritized this would be in my mind because it just like impacts everything because it's just like if you go into like a cutscene, you see your character like waddle up like just walk up and be like hey i'm walking into this building gonna talk to this npc and then it's like Okay, well, the hunch is there. And I mean, I've gotten used to it over time, but this is one of the things that I hear a lot from players that, like, look to play Rothgar, is they're like, I can't really get over the fact that my character that used to always stand straight when I would say, like, playing Makode, like, because, like, I played the demo or whatever, um, like, the free trial until Stormblood, yeah, yeah, all the memes that <laughs> critically acclaimed, but, um, they're just like, now I go from my Miko to Rothgar, and now, like, the hunch is really noticeable. Like, when new players play Rothgar, their big complaints are, I want more hairstyles, I can't wear hats, my character's hunched over. Like, that is consistently the three things I hear. Obviously, hats and hairstyles are being worked on. It's just like we have that new, like, man bun, like, um, hairstyle from the Dawn Terrell trailer added to Rothgar, which is something, yes, I did notice in the trailer. Is it my style? Mm. How to say it without being offensive? Okay, moving on. Not for me. I do not like man buns. I always hated them, even when they were, like, super trendy. Ah. Excuse me, sir. You just got cancelled on Twitter. Tell me something new. Every day. Actually, it's X now. But yeah, getting Rothgar, male Rothgar, because females stand erect, they have no problem standing erect, but male Rothgar, making them stand erect is like the number one thing to me. If World of Warcraft had the technology in 2018, and this is like before the entire Shadowbringers, WoW Exodus, and before that huge thing that kind of impacted the world for years, if we had the technology back then, we have the technology now. Arg, it's just, it's one of those things that in the back of my mind, I didn't really say it because kind of I've been on a little bit of a content hiatus because my fiance is just destroyed me. Can I even call them that anymore? Ex fiance. I'm not gonna go down that path, but my point is, I, this is maybe something I should have been more vocal on like before, because now it's just like, now we're getting closer to Dawn Terrell. Now I'm just like, Okay, why, why in this huge graphics update do we not have this one thing? Arg, because the characters already stand it. World of Warcraft had the technology in 2018. Why?